good morning guys so today's video i'm going to be doing a day in my life um an army day in my life do i have another oh it's my hair and right now i'm doing my hair I'm trying to kill two birds with one stone and just kind of introduce the video first uh introduce the video so we have to meet up in what we call the day room and just kind of go over what we're going to be doing today today we're we've We've already staged our trucks for a convoy that we're doing um, tomorrow. Is today Thursday? I'm, I'm really not, I don't even know what day it is right now. Um, but we have a convoy going out um, Friday. So we got our trucks all staged and today we're just um, going to f uh, fuel up so that we're ready to go in the morning. We have to like leave really early pretty early like seven o'clock so that means that we have to be down to the motor pool at like six so it's gonna be a long day tomorrow um so i'm gonna bring you guys along the process um i'm, I'm not sure how much i'm gonna be able to film um in the motor pool since it's just kind of like a busy area um so i will definitely get as much footage today as possible just to kind of let you guys see um what it's like it's hot today so i'm not even gonna bother putting on makeup thumbs up this video if you're about to leave for basic combat training in the next month the 30 days or less thumbs up this video if you are Good luck to you all. Enjoy yourself. Let's go. What time is it? I've got five minutes. Okay. Got my car keys, got my room key, and my truck keys. be downstairs at seven. Mimi. I know that means a little bit earlier, but you know, it's right there. Headed to the motor pool right now and getting the day started. It's gonna be a long one. Hopefully not as long as yesterday, but it's gonna be pretty long. I look like a little kid right now because I have no makeup on. Not that I, I mean like, I don't care that I don't wear makeup, but like sometimes I just like, this uniform already makes me look like a boy. So, I don't know. I feel like it makes me look younger. La, la, la. Hopefully this camera doesn't fall. Just about to say it's probably going to fall. Anywho. Oh man. So I'm probably gonna switch cameras to my phone just because I don't want this camera to get any more ruined than it is. Um I when I went to Florida a few weeks ago, I was sitting in a hammock. I don't know if I even explained this, but I was but I was sitting in a hammock and um, the camera, like I had it with me. I wasn't even using it, and, but it was in my hand. And the camera, like when I fell out the hammock, it got in the sand. So like half of the lens doesn't close and it has like a little bit of sand in it. You can't really tell, but it's kind of annoying. Like, yeah, so. I don't want to get it any more ruined than it is already. So I'm going to switch to my phone. Oh, I guess they're parking in the motor pool. I, some units will let you uh, park in your car in the uh, motor pool. I rarely do because you just never know. Sorry, I can, you just like really never know if the 
could be a nail or something like it's it's happened i've seen it happen so many times where people had um nails in their tire from driving in a motor pool that is not in the budget So this is like a few days later, but um, it's so early right now. I think it's like six something and I've been up since five o'clock this morning. But this video, it might be all over the place a little bit, but that's just the army. That's just how it is. I can't always sit down and just film, you know, like we're just like, go, go, go. I tell you, to all, tell you that all the time. The army is a very fast paced um, profession especially when you're working outside a lot like I do I work in the motor pool a lot we go a lot of different places um, we're about like two ish hours from our home base and we're at another base right now um, so yeah um, the last few days we just been well what did I do I've been here for two days and we're about to leave um, we're leaving at 909 to go back to our home base um, we'll see if we SP at that time. SP means starting point, which means we're about to leave, like leaving SP. Um, so hopefully we SP at the right time. I don't know. I'll show you guys around my truck a little bit. So this is just the, what the front looks like. This is what the motor pool that we're parking at kind of looks like right now. It has grass and it literally rained like crazy last night. Like we were out here and it poured raining, like poured raining. I mean, like, it was like a lake over there. Um, anyway, so this is the cab. These are all my buttons. You guys see me pushing sometimes. All of these. These are the lights. And this is, like, the gear and stuff. Park brake for the truck. And this is for the trailer. All those buttons. The most important buttons on the truck are right here. All the gauges and whatnot. This is a 915, so um, your 88 mics will be doing. This will be the second to last, or the second truck you guys will train on when you go to AIT. Kevlar. It's a little dirty right now. These are what we call slave cables, just jumper cables for trucks. Um, these. This is the TM. You guys will learn. 88 mics will learn what a TM is. Um, this is our dispatch. Like I said, this is another. This is not really Kevlar, it's a hard hat. And this is my cot back here. I always sleep back here whenever I get some time to go to sleep. 
and just my bags and all that stuff. This is a drip pan. Chalk block is outside right now. And yeah, I've got a fire extinguisher. We got two. We got, I think we have to have two. So yeah, that is my crib, guys. <laughs> and there's some more space like right there too, but I don't really use it that much. Too much. So yeah, that is my truck. Hi guys, so I'm back home. Um, and let me tell you, there is no better feeling than taking off your boots after a long day. But I um, showered and all that stuff. It was actually the next day. And I'm getting ready to go out of town. So I hope you all enjoyed this Army Day in my life. It's been like over a span of a few days anyway. But I hope you guys kind of enjoyed it and get a little insight on what it's like. And I'm going to go finish some packing. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.